heavyweight collision between Junior Dos Santos and Ty Tuivasa. Representing Western Sydney in New South Wales, here is Ty Tuivasa, the heavyweight contender, has been all systems go since making his debut in the big show. This is a heavyweight force to be reckoned with, and as the skills start to catch up with the hunger and the desire, many believe Tuivasa could be a future UFC champion. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. Here is the former UFC heavyweight champion, Junior Dos Santos. Do not mistake his kindness for weakness. Sagano's UFC tenure, truly the stuff of legends. Started the UFC career 9-0 out of the shoot. Who can forget the knockout of Fabricio Verdum in his UFC debut at UFC 90. JDS is back, and Joe seemingly better than ever. Junior Dos Santos is a very dangerous striker. He's got precision punches with knockout power behind them. He has been putting top-level guys to sleep since he came to the UFC. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. The Australian is 25, the Brazilian is 34. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. Now for the introductions, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record on. Ten wins, no losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Sydney, Australia, Tom Bam Bam! Two wins! And now we're using the opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding professional record on. Nineteen wins, five losses. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 238 pounds. Fighting out of Salvador Bahia, Brazil. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC heavyweight champion, Junior Cigarro Dos You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after Ready, it. Fight. Ready. Well, good to have you with us. And right on time, I might add, as we get underway here at the O2 Arena in London, England. So we get another... Oh! Getting off some very nice grounded pound here. Ty Tuivasa gets up cool. He wanted this fight. Oh, he got oh. clipped there. He got clipped.
lethal strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, Joe, we're just getting going, and there's the end of the fight. So it's a win by first round knockout, near perfect on the technique. I'm not even sure his opponent saw that thing coming. And really, before his opponent had a chance to get in the fight at all and land anything in terms of a significant strike, he was knocked out. So major, major transpiration here tonight. Let's see if we get a better look at that from this angle. Here it is one more time. Oh, man. K.O. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory that could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Beach called the stop to this contest at 1 minute, 16 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by Knockout Junior. So congratulations to Sagano Jr. Dos Santos on yet another big win here tonight. Maybe his son Bento's even old enough now to be watching his dad go to work. And if so, what an inspiring effort he saw in this one. Junior Dos Santos lighting up this arena with his performance tonight.